Hello, this is Tor from IDCON. The video you're about to see is an older video. It's from 1993. It's of my father lecturing in some paper mill, I believe. Uh, he talks about what happens when the operations manager, the maintenance manager, and the mill manager pull in different directions. Let's see what he has to say. This describes the situation in many mills. <coughs> the blindfolded driver there, that's Bruce here, that's the maintenance manager, <laughs> driving the car or something. We don't know really where we're going. We have goals and we have everything. We like to keep the budget and everything. This is the plant manager <laughs> reading the rear view mirror because that's history. Now he's reading your budget and say, hey, last quarter we had a high maintenance cost. That's history. That's not, that's not the head. That's what's gone already, okay? Anyway, looking at cost, that's what, what I was saying. Looking at cost, or perhaps that's what we're probably going to do in the future. And the backseat driver there, that's the operations manager in that department that says, drive faster. But I have a problem here. Fix it on the run. And we have trapped in a system where this guy, the operations manager, says, run, run the equipment. Don't shut it down. Don't shut it down. And if you shut it down, fix it quick so we can be up running soon and we fix it right later. And later you know how that comes, right? And so, so, so we are trapped in the system here. It's very difficult for a maintenance manager to say, what, are, what is your maintenance cost going to be this year? How can you answer that? <coughs> well, the need for maintenance really comes from how you run the equipment and how do you, what kind of maintenance do you, what do you request? It starts when you request the maintenance jobs, that's when you initiate the maintenance cost, right? I hope this doesn't describe it, but I've seen that on walls in a lot of mills with names on these people. <laughs> so how do we get out of this situation? We have the plant manager just looking at the rear view mirror at financial results that happened months ago. We have the operations manager that only care about how much we can produce this shift. We have the maintenance manager that's just doing whatever he's told to do, a service organization that's fixing problems. The key here, at least for equipment reliability, is to get the three managers together and jointly work on equipment reliability. So perhaps we need to start with making the maintenance manager an equal partner to the operations, not a service organization. The outcome of good maintenance work is not service and time and material. The outcome is equipment reliability. And operations needs to focus on the process reliability. So maintenance on the equipment reliability, operations on the process reliability, of course there's huge overlap in between those two. And of course the plant manager needs to start looking ahead, what are the problems and the opportunities that lay out in the future, a month from now, a year from now. Anyways, thanks for watching.